Hey guys, I just want to show you a little video. Um, I managed to uh, get some uh, RBG LEDs. Um, I ordered them from uh, Flytron and uh, took a while to get um, to the point where I actually thought they might have been lost in the mail. So I contacted the guys at Flytron and uh, said I was basically going to, um, to possibly uh, make a claim just to get my money back because I just assumed they were lost in the mail and recently we had changes with our mail uh, box um, orientation and whatnot and I've been getting people other people's mail so I don't know if the, the post workers don't know what's on the go or if they're drunk or if they're smoking that Chiba so I don't know what's on the go but anyways I thought it was lost uh, so they uh, <coughs> they offered to uh, to send resend the package to me I guess because most companies don't want negative feedback even if it is for lost um, lost postage or whatnot so but anyways um, I got two strips uh, they came with servo leads um, this came with servo leads um, on so I had to uh, I had to just do uh, a couple couple snips and whatnot and just made it uh, cut them to uh, the size I think each strip had eight or something like that and uh, I forget exactly how many I used I think uh, no actually I think each had ten so I had twenty total but I just ended up using um, sixteen total so I had four left over two from each strip so if I'm a time back I think I pro probably just would have used the ten and the, excuse me, the whole um, front arm would have been done, whatnot. So, so anyways, um, the way I have it set up uh, with Clean Flight, you can uh, you can set your lights to uh, for different orientations, arm state, um, indicators. Uh, just a couple different features. Um, hang on, now, cause this is it goes. I'm just gonna arm and. Because um, it goes after uh, a few minutes of inactivity, it uh, starts giving warnings. So uh, the way I had it set up, I, I didn't do nothing really with the front. I just uh, the four inners. Let's see if I can get this in view. <clears throat> the four inners I just um, are green, um, but change blue when when the frame is armed and well with the uh, the new uh, the new setup with clean flight um, after five seconds it disarms by itself so I just ran uh, on the back we have um, I was more concerned with with the back or whatnot um, as you can see, I have white in the middle, and two outers uh, are red. Oops. <coughs> so, if I give aileron, you can get this in view. Left and right, and the more you more you bank your stick. So it's just just a little bit. The more you bank, the faster the the blinking goes until it's pretty much it looks solid on camera but it's it's flickering pretty uh, pretty fast uh, when I when I pull back like that and when I go all the way back like I say it looks solid but it's actually flickering to me on the camera it looks like it's um, solid um, and then the center four I have um, when I give throttle they change colors this is about mid stick and this is full so yeah it's pretty cool uh, it took me a while to uh, 
to get <laughs> to get it worked out in clean flight, but it's not not that bad. I watched a couple of videos and uh, used Google. So um, there's a couple pretty cool setup um, instruction uh, tutorials there uh, by a guy named Oscar. Uh, I forget his last name, but uh, <clears throat> he's got a, <coughs> a couple of good. Uh, Good video. So basically, in uh, Clean Flight, you just have to enable LED strip, and I'm running PPM. So the the LED has three wires. It's got your positive, and negative, and your signal. So the signal pin has to be broken apart and put into pin five, which is in under the power pin of the PPM. So the first three inputs, usually that you use on the, on the NAS board. I had one here but I got it put away but pin 5 yeah you can see it there uh, that has to have the signal and what I ended up doing is I use one of these ready-made RC um, 12 volt uh, 5 volt step downs so 5 volts is coming here to power flight controller which then in turn powers the receiver so I had an open port so I have my four motors then I have the positive and negative on the uh, positive and negative rail from the NAS powering the lights and then just the signal is branched off and goes to pin 5 and that's about it and uh, in clean flight if you have it uh, the grid basically um, it's orientated like this so in the top corner I have my uh, my four and then the other corner is the other four and the back two corners and the bottom is the four and the four and you just assign them how you want so that's pretty cool um, yeah so that is pretty much how I have the, uh, the LEDs um, I just have to so that is pretty much how I have my uh, RBG LEDs set up so anyways guys Thanks for watching.